welcome to Talking Balls. Uh, I don't know why I do that. This week, Sir Alex Ferguson carries out a subtle attack on a Champions League spokesman after their exit from the competition. Uh, it's been around a long time, um, and as a result, it does take quite a long time to make change, even with the best one in the world. <laughs> Oh, best video ever. <laughs> and uh, Mario Balotelli's neighbours grow sick and tired of his antics. Oh my god, trampoline! Trampoline! <laughs> oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah, oh my god, trampoline! Uh, now listen, we couldn't have just any Tom Deacon Harry. Oh, you won't get the joke yet, you will shortly. Joining Jim and Neil this week as a guest. So we got comedian and current Radio 1 DJ, current. Tom Deacon! Yay! Thank you. Thanks. Thank you very much. Woo! Are we high fiving. Yeah. Oh, hang on. Uh, Chris, no. Anyway, the point <laughs> is, <laughs> yeah, I've got the noisy chair. I've noticed that. Jim had it last week. You've got it this week. Um, it's going round. Whoa. I think that's just your your dodgy knee. Isn't it? <laughs> it could be. Yeah. It could be. That is that is uncomfortable. I would imagine that's how Owen Hargreaves' knee sounds <laughs> when he walks. Yeah. Do it, do it, and let's pretend that Owen's walking. Oh yeah, there, that's him getting up. If you watch one of those YouTube training videos he was doing. <laughs> yeah. that's, that's why the music's like really that. loud yeah. on them, so you can't hear it. Uh, Tom Deacon. Hi. Okay, do you want me to read my card for Batum? You can do. Does it start with, how are you? Like, last <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I've mixed up. Oh, I've mixed up. Well How's it going? <laughs> It's going well. Yeah. Uh, out of 10, I'd say it was about a 9 today. Sweet. It's a strong day. We Has started it, well. Did you, were breakfast. you at 10 and have declined during the no, show no, no, or you no, just no. come I think up? You start at naught at the beginning of the day and you work oh, okay. up. Wow. Yeah. Well, that's, I don't, yeah. Is that different to everyone else? I don't know. I don't know because I would always think if you had like a. Imagine you had a. Like a not a, ter well, a terminal illness. That would be <laughs> zero. Yeah. So when you haven't got a terminal illness and you're aware of that, I'd say you wake yeah. up at 5. Not that's as quite early. Fight, that's <laughs> quite early. <laughs> 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 oh, uh, to follow now. <laughs> you say, are we having the best day? Are we? Are we? Are we? It's nine and a half. Nine and a half. Nine nine and half. Right, I'll put it up to nine and a half. Joe Tuesday. Yeah, it's, sure. it's a solid day. This is very nice. Mm. Apart from the uncomfortable chair, mm. I feel like you did that deliberately. But other than that. Mm. You wouldn't have no. thought that four emos wearing black could get on quite so well in a studio. I'm not Shut an, up! I'm not an emo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not an emo. <laughs> I don't, is that what emo is? What's 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 a mal coordinated emo, was that? <laughs> I don't know what an emo is, I don't get the reference. Anyway, listen, guys, uh, you're a Southampton fan? I am, yes. I'm, well, I'm born and bred from Southampton and I've always followed them, but I'm also an Ipswich fan as well. Um, what? Does yeah. How does that work? Uh, yeah. There's a rule you only meant to support one football team. Yeah. I don't know if you're aware of this. I'm always I'm a maverick. I always break rules. <laughs> I'm a loose cannon. <laughs> 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 okay. Well, <laughs> did you start at zero teams and, and you're up to? Yeah, two I built now. up yeah, uh, okay. on the day. Yeah, two. No, no. I follow, you, uh, you have to follow the team you're, you're from. I think that's. that's so where? Why Ipswich? Though? Uh, Ipswich because it's the first ever match I went to see, and uh, my dad wasn't really a football fan. Mm. So well, um, of course, he supports Ipswich. <laughs> <laughs> Zing! Oh, excellent! <laughs> <laughs> that was. Oh, <laughs> to you! <laughs> no, sorry, uh, Switch. Sorry, Switch, I don't care. Oh, <laughs> get lost, Ipswich. Uh, anyway, Ipswich had a good uh, weekend. Yeah, great comeback. Zing. Two 0 down. Um, they were two 0 down. Yes, yeah. But, uh, don't don't find out the story. Um, but the point is. Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, no, no. Um, I just ended up supporting them because um, no one said support Southampton. They just said, you know, mm. follow the first team. And they beat Man United. And I was told Man United were the best team. 3-2. That year they went on to lose 9-0. So the point is, <laughs> yeah. be careful who you support. So I've always followed them. <laughs> yeah. And um, But yeah, they were 2-0 down at the weekend. And they are pretty terrible this mm. season. Uh, with, even with the likes of Lebo, yeah. Yeah. Southampton did all right, though. Yeah, Sorry. Saints are flying, as long as they can hold on to it. Although Bilisowski uh, made the worst blunder <gasps> that I've possibly... I, I, you're right. I genuinely, <laughs> so bad. I genuinely cried when watching that. Like, I was just like, how has this happened? How, that, was your how? Tweet. that was your last tweet two days ago, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah, how has this happened? Mm. Like, I was just, I was on my own. I was just, oh, we're mm. so in this game. And then, uh, mm. they didn't, the thing is, I think it's quite risky in football when you don't have a replacement goalkeeper on the bench. Yeah. They didn't have one. Um, I like that. It usually means John Terry goes in. Really? For Chelsea, John Terry always takes the gloves. I think every team's got somebody who does it in training. Like, Theo Zagarakis used to do it for Leicester and he was five foot six. That was Fabian Bates. He was quite a small little yeah. bald man. <laughs> <laughs> he was quite the, a the, small little bald The best man. bit about the Southampton keeper of the weekend wasn't the one he dropped through his legs for yeah. the equaliser. It was the one in the first half where for some reason he, he was diving for the ball yeah. and just forgot to use his hands. Yeah. He just tried chesting the ball in mid-air. It was, and it it was a cross. Did that, it, it was a cross and he just went, nah, chest. He was trying to do a Balotelli. 
Yeah. 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 Oh, go on. Oh, I'm oh. for a sketch yet. Oh, I've got the. Oh. <laughs> I can use my. Uh, I wondered why I was. Uh. Um, take it away from football, which is yeah. something we like to do on this show. Forget, forget sport. Uh, <laughs> but you currently host this uh, Radio One show. Tell us about the show. Okay. <laughs> that was really good, wasn't it? That was almost like you were on a different television. Like it was, uh, hang on. There we go. Okay. Now <laughs> the yeah. um, it's, on a, it's on a Sunday night just after the chat. So Reggie Yates passed over to me. Uh, teen show from 7 pm till 9 pm. Um, playing a lot of pop music. Mm. It's kind are, you, of are you a pop music fan? I like a bit of pop. Who doesn't like a bit of pop now and again? You me? love a bit of pop. Uh, no, I do like pop. I'm a massive fan of Go West. And I still think you know they're written off too soon. <laughs> <laughs> no, they were. You're also a fan of Mechanic and the Mics, weren't you? <laughs> <laughs> we we found, found out before. I love 80s music, Hall and Oates. I'm you trying never, to get, you know, get Cheeky Girls like back in. Really? Yeah, it's much better. I think they were fantastic. Dress sense, they had everything. I love mm. the fact that one of the Cheeky Girls, despite them being twins, is definitely fitter than the other. Yeah, oh, that's it's... true. And also, one of them bought me a drink once. Spilt, spilt a drink at this terrible... Uh, fashion thing I was at, and then in protest or <laughs> yeah. 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 Why am I here? I'm the ugly one. <laughs> yeah. I'm my life. Uh, no, I, no. She spilled my drink and then felt bad and bought me another one. That's not very cheeky. No, it wasn't. It's the opposite of cheeky. <laughs> oh, I generous. wish I'd done that. You I wish I'd done that. Oh, cheeky. You did make it sound uh, like it was a chat up thing though, but she's just merely buying a replacement drink rather than this being a definite come on. Oh no, it wasn't a come on. No, mm. I'd have declined if it was. I'd have gone thank you, but on no. What thank grounds? You, cheeky. I don't know. I'd feel about them. I don't like them. Were they wearing hot pants at the time? No, in fact, they, 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 it was it was one of those events, and they were wearing like quite nice, uh, you know, quite nice clothes, like clothes that you wouldn't necessarily. <laughs> you just weren't in the mood. You, you just weren't you just in, the mood. in the mood on the night. I was like, no, I love the now. drink, but please leave me to look at the wall. Thank yeah, you. yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm counting tiles. Um, now listen, Tom, All right. or Deco. Deco, I like Deco. Deco. I like Deco, Deco too. It's a, what a great name to have as a surname for because that is great. Deco is like boom. Hey, Deco's in the Deco's yeah. in the building. That's what people might <laughs> building. say. Building. What's the matter with Deco? Hey, hey, you know? hey, hey somebody Deco. get Deco on the phone. Hey, De Deco, I'll say the same thing again. Deco's in the building. I can't just freestyle like you guys. I can't riff. All right, yeah. <laughs> I wrote that last night and I've stuck with it. So um, now we do keep up challenges. People, yes. people come on. Yes. Uh, people just, people, if you want to come on, just <laughs> give us a shout and uh, we'll do it. No, and they do a keep up challenge. Uh, here's the leaderboard. Uh, so at the top, uh, weirdly, is a professional footballer, uh, Seb Basong. Then it's Ollie Mraz. And then it's Tom Rosenthal, rodent. Um, because that's what he comes up on my phone when I type Rosenthal. He comes up right up. So, Tom Rosenthal, who now is a BBC Comedy Awards nominee. Ah. Uh, is he? Yeah. Oh, oh, he's he's, he's gone now. He's not on the show anymore. Oh, so, <coughs> give him a so, text. I'm assuming, listen, I will move this if I need to, yeah. but it's blue tack and it's, mm, it's cumbersome. So it if you could like get less you want me to do less than, yeah. <laughs> if you could, j yeah. just for convenience, but I, would, I want you to do well. So here are the rules. You have to take your shoes off, first and foremost. Ollie Murr's made up these rules. Oh, okay. So you take your shoes off, it's a flat ball, you get two attempts. The first one is a, oh, just do it quickly, do like a plaster. There we go. Do you want to get up? <laughs> the first one is, um, is a practice attempt, but you can take it if it ends up being your better attempt. So basically you just get two attempts. I don't know why I go into such detail okay, there. Okay, well now, if I go over 13, I'll say, say, say that's a practice one, and then I'll do it mm. rubbish the next no, one. No, don't, no, I want you to smash yourself up. Well, smash well, it, mate. Hey, go, 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 go. That's more like it. Yeah, yeah there right. we go. Take the shoes off first, eh? Rock his little blue oh, tackle. did they just slip off? Don't slip go. them oh. off. Oh. 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 Please do that. Oh. That is. Uh, here's where you're going to stand. <laughs> you're going to stand about, about I'm feeling a little bit ill now. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. Stand about here. The Stand corner. about here. Come, come, come. Okay. Stand about here. That's weird. That's, That's, fair That's now. That's really it. weird. That's it there. <laughs> you know, screen you know, right I there. look like I'm going to take him out of action. Yeah. Yeah. So right, listen, hey, hey. Just in case you're... Yes. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Yes. Listen, hey, listen. This is, this is it, all right? This is yours. This is my moment. Hey, hey. Are you, is hey. this a Marty McCutcheon moment? Hey. <laughs> Hey. He doesn't know what that's like. Okay, uh, in your own time. One, two, three, four. Alternate. Five, six, seven, eight. Glass table. Whoa, oh, eight. Okay. Eight practice. Okay, that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad for a practice. Now, everyone has. Go get your own ball. <laughs> now, everyone in practice. Everyone in practice has done worse on their first and their second. They tend to smash it second time. I think the nerves are gone. Uh, my suggestion, my little tip to you. Yeah. Psyching me out. Yeah. My, little mm. my little tip to you would be get the knees involved because it's very nice. It's very yeah. easy to get those knees going. Yeah. Eh? And just want it more, right? Because right, out there you just didn't seem to want <laughs> it, eh? I just hey. didn't, I didn't know hey. what to do when I got near the goal. I just didn't know if what to do. <laughs> if they're in, yeah? Hey. Yeah. And yeah. you just need to, and you push it, eh? And you push it. Yeah, just keep but, going that direction. But get, <laughs> but get them up and keep them up. Off you go, best of luck. All right. Your, time's, <laughs> your time starts, uh, there's no time. 
been weirder than you asking a man to get them up and keep them. Up. <laughs> <laughs> Not the first time. Well, all okay, <laughs> here we go. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Is this right, Gaffer? And you're going, yes. <laughs> yes. I'm just doing that. Good, good. Right, here we go. Best of luck, best of luck to you. Here we go. This is it. It's yours. Two, three, four, four. Oh. Mm. Sit a bit. <laughs> 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 ah. oh, we never had such a disappointment. Is that eight, though? Eight eight, eight, eight. It means I don't have to. Actually, I'm pleased. It means I don't have to. Do you do that on purpose? Yeah. I'm just going to put, do you go? Well, you didn't want to move the, the, the thing. Do you go? And I'll put in the building. Like that. Building eight. Uh, Tom Deacon scores eight. Yeah, so uh, I was pleased with that. Were you pleased with that? Uh, yeah, ecstatic. Um, it's kind of ruined the rest of the flow <coughs> for the show, in my opinion. Have you dropped down Why? to a seven? Well, just it, you know, just the, the, the forcing me to go there, and I, I feel like I could have done better, mm. and you know, and mm. oh, just you, have you dropped from a nine now? Yeah, it's, 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 it's a solid eight. That's <laughs> <laughs> well, so appropriate. Right, we'll, do that. we'll deal with that. Uh, now, join us after the break when we'll make this into a uh, panel show. That's what happens. Bow, magic, magic. People come in, no one comes in. <laughs> See you in a bit. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Talking Balls. I'm Chris Cohen, that's Jim Smallman, that is Neil Cole, and that is, of course, Tom Deacon, or as uh, me and the rest of his mates I like to call him. Deco! Deco is in the building! <laughs> <laughs> He's in the building, y'all! Yo! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, is it you're, right? You're I know where else to go with that. Yo! Oh. Um, now listen, you do, I mean I do some strong impressions you've just seen. Uh, you do some good impressions I hear of, of sporting people and you were telling me you've got a favourite at the moment. Who's, uh, who's your favourite? Well you know what I mean, it's Mick, Mick McCarthy. Oh, uh, I love Mick McCarthy. McCarthy. Uh, you know, let's play well. Um, <laughs> Trying to get it in the box, you couldn't have against United, they're too good. And uh, it's my favourite <laughs> one, just keeps like going around. I like it. Mates call me up and I try and pretend to be Mick McCarthy. And I just say that the best bit about that impression oh. is you actually had the same facial expression as well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And the nose, you made the nose bend round as well. Mick <laughs> yeah. oh, McCarthy. Mick, um, what do you think your chances are against United and the likes of Man City? Well, you know, we're trying to buy a few players, but they're just uh, <laughs> too expensive. <laughs> and uh, you've got to work with what you've got, really. You know, I, I liked your generic Sky Sports presenter words as well. So, big game coming up tonight <laughs> at the Emirates, Mick. Well, Ooh, yeah. difficult. Imagine yeah, what don't. it would be like if Colin Murray were to interview him. Yeah, man. what would that, what that be like? <laughs> <laughs> Neil, come on, don't help me out. Um, no, but I, 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 I used to love playing. I'm going to crowbar it into your stand. Don't you always mention it, Colin Murray? Yeah, yeah, everywhere I go, Neil's always going, oh, Colin Murray this and Colin Murray that. Just get out of here. Do you, Colin Murray? Do you, Colin Murray? I like it. That's me, Colin Murray, here right now. And that's a kid just doing a generic Northern Irish family. Okay. If you wore his glasses, it would. Be more like it. Johnny? Alright, cool. I can't see anything then. We're over here. Yeah. Well, goodbye to match of the dates, me, Colin Murray here. <laughs> I've got Alan over there. I'm going to try and sound as excited as he possibly can, Alan. Hey, uh, but yeah, and that's. <laughs> 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 we're going to do it. Excellent. We're going to do it. Excellent. Right, now, they're, hang on. They're uh, nice glasses. They're alright, aren't they? They yeah, suit nice. you. They suit you. Yeah. They suit you. I can uh, see, but. Suit you. <laughs> uh, anyway. Round one. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, right, before, before, round we, one. before we uh, oh, for days. <laughs> before we uh, start the game, we give out uh, horns uh, or hooters or whistles or bells. Uh, we've got all the bells and whistles here. <laughs> I don't know why they just come up that. Zing number two <laughs> in the bag. That'll make the DVD. What do you like, a whistle, a bell, or a horn? Uh, <laughs> I love the uh, can I have the horn. Yeah. No, I've got a chair. To be honest, I've got a chair. <laughs> uh, if I want to say so, I just... Here it comes. Here it comes. Uh, oh. nice. Neil Cole, bell or whistle? Uh, whistle, please. Uh, uh, bell or bell? Bell. Uh. <laughs> okay, let's play this game. Let's do this. In the build! <laughs> is in... Round one is in the sporting news. <laughs> Don't, I'm trying to... We uh, work it. I didn't know. We started, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. We started. <laughs> yeah. starting a... and now. <coughs> round one is in the sporting news. We show our guests a collection of sporting clips and our guests have to work out who or what they're about. Let's have a look at clip one, guys. Your whistle's in your eye. He's going down in. He's always got a bit of a goal. He's always got a bit of a goal. He's always Oh, oh. oh. It's not just a Negro that's going to bring water to his eyes. 
Oh, he's called Vin. That was excellent. Yeah, no, you can see This is the one, guys. Look at it, look at it. That's where the contract is. I think he's left his foot in. He's left his foot in a bit. Literal Now, what? That didn't look Where was that? That doesn't look right. That's a great question. Is it Mexico? Because they're sponsored by a Mexican beer company. During the Mexican yeah. tie between Santos and Tigres, Juan Rodriguez put his foot through the ball. I need the to see it, it nestled flush in Manuel Vinegra's special place. Uh, that was, oh, but you know what? That was a conscious decision. You, you can tell when the foot angles was from point. there yeah. to, hang on a minute, yeah. I'm going in. Mm -hmm. uh, the ref smiles Stay away on well. target. Yeah. You ever been kicked in the balls, Tom? Uh, yeah, when I played football and it's horrible, isn't it? by a female. Um, but that <laughs> is, um, that's, is that that's, that's, that's painful. Yeah. That is... Oh. But it was a handball. Uh, it was. Everyone's ignoring that. Yeah. Yeah. Was it balls to hand though? No. <laughs> it was foot to ball. I mean, I, um, we all do balls to hand every now and again, don't we? Balls <laughs> to foot. <laughs> a little bit of foot. innuendo. I once. Uh, I used to skateboard because right. I'm Well Street, yeah, like you, cool. Chris Cohen. Yeah. And once I did one of those things, you know, where you, you jump Why on a are you rail. Doing that? Hang on a minute. Why are you doing Because I want to be Patrick Moore. <laughs> <laughs> the <laughs> sky is very faster. dark at night. <laughs> this, I can't see anything. For this week's challenge, I have chosen Sonic the Hedgehog. I'm going to take a minute. It's Games so, Master. Yeah. I'm too young. No, no, I, I enjoyed Games Master because yeah. you go up and you go, Games Master, I found it really difficult. At level 15, I can't get past the evil monster. And you go, well, what do you need to do? Oh, no, no, I, thought, I thought we were going to. Let's, let's have a pretend uh, Games right. Master moment. He, Is this goes, riffing? He's yeah. not very good at it. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you started doing my bit. <laughs> go. <laughs> <laughs> you're, having problems, you're having problems with Golden Axe. Go. Golden Axe? Yeah, do it. Go. Do, oh, yeah, go. Um, uh, Games Master, I find it really difficult on Golden Axe. I can't find the Golden Axe. Where is it hidden? Well, right. So the second <laughs> bit. <laughs> Can I finish my second. story? Yes. Yeah. Just 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 story. <laughs> well, you mentioned, just just mentioned me off. to riff on Games Master. <laughs> With this, they should bring it back. I'm listening to him. Because I'm having some difficulties on Captain Thanks America. Thanks America Thanks so. yeah. <laughs> um, Go. What happened was I was skateboarding and I went up on a rail. Like thinking I was. Were you grinding? Flavor. I was grinding on a rail, but then oh, my right. skateboard snapped and I landed. <gasps> the only nice way of saying this oh. is testes first on a rail Ooh. and then fell off the rail Ooh. and I had to go to hospital and I heard the phrase that no gentleman ever wants to hear from a nurse. She said, Mr. Smallman, just try and stay calm and we'll see if we can coax them back down. <laughs> <laughs> I've had, um, if we're talking injuries, I've, I've had uh, it drained at one um, <laughs> <laughs> why? why footballing injury? So that's it it just blood, the blood went backwards in, and uh, it just stayed there. So they had to. <laughs> worst thing about it though, it was it was painful, but they put me on a woman's ward. Um, <laughs> and if there's any way of saying, well, was it so bad? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a shocker. Is that because it was that serious? There was a worry you might change gender. Yeah, because I was thinking, oh, <laughs> Dr. Surgeon, Mr. <laughs> shaky Hand. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. So imagine waking up thinking. Oh, you thinking it seems a bit strange, isn't it? With the doctor coming in and going, "Oh, you're awake now. We've got some news. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. These." <laughs> yeah. uh, lovely. I mean, it's great. Just I, would, I, I would like to find out if he was injured. That that poor man. We yeah. literally, uh, we've literally been uh, talking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 Zing! My, uh, my, let's my... have a look at another clip, shall we? Let's shut up, Neil. Shut up, Neil. <laughs> Get lost, Neil. Let's have a look at another clip. Actually, have a look at this. Oh, now what's going on here? Uh, back down. Yeah. Oh, do you remember pages? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hated pages because you used to have to, if you wanted to flirt with a girl, you'd have to read it to a stranger first. I thought that Jan Aga Fjortoft is involved in this. Oh. Yeah, now what this is, is... Uh, this is chronic pain and how it can hit you at any moment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's no, yeah, in, uh, a Norwegian TV advert. show. <laughs> yeah. Got pain Clouds. in the leg. Ah! ah. Oh, what is happening to them? Uh, basically, what it is, a Norwegian TV show strapped these dog collars onto players' legs. Basically, there's a... <laughs> is that what it is? It's the way you just go, I can't do this anymore. Um, oh, yeah. oh, 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 dear. Wow. Not doing much for the women's game there. She's enjoying that too much. Didn't you make a penalty? Get away. You what, a yeah, woman? You pen no, a woman or a tag. <laughs> a tag. Uh, but basically, what it is... They're, 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 we used, we've got it, my parents have got it. There's a, a, like a wire that you put around the, the circumference. Got tights. Yeah, wait, <laughs> wait, wait. Uh, there's like a wire you put around um, the garden, under like about a foot into the floor of the garden. And then you put the collars on the cat, 
and the, it beeps when they get near, and then if you get too near, it gives them a tiny little shock. But what you can do is ramp it right up for like a really large dog or whatever, which we did, <laughs> which we did the first day, and our cats went, mm, we nearly lost them all. Um, but it stops them going out. But what they've obviously done is strapped it to a player's legs and decided to influence the game by giving them electric shocks. And I think it could catch on. <laughs> that is genius. You know, that's a that lot needs, more entertaining, that. That, that needs the Benny Hill music attached <laughs> to it. <laughs> 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 um, do you, we could use that in the Premier League. We should, we should use this in this studio. It would stop David Silver. I, I think I think it should um, mindless uh, fuggery, just, just on a night out. Uh, mm. Premiership football players should wear that on a night out and... Um, which would be great, you know, just we, keep the likes of Ashley Cole in check. And so what, we give, the, we give the activating thing yeah. to a girlfriend or whatever. And Ashley then Cole in check, as in Petter check. I would keep him in check. That was a good, good reference, oh. yeah. Because um, um, <laughs> Peter check is the goalkeeper. Yeah. Uh, he has that little helmet. Maybe they could just put that on underneath his hat <laughs> and he just do that a little <laughs> yeah, bit now and again. Um, yeah. If Andy Carroll, had, if you put one on Andy Carroll and then just give it to a teammate and just say, if he goes anywhere near a kebab shop, <laughs> yeah. just switch it uh, up. Uh, well, um, <laughs> Yeah, so there we go. That was that was uh, Norwegian. We've got one more clip. Do you want to see it, guys? Do you want to yes. see it? Should we have a bit more fun? Let's have yeah. a bit more fun. fun. Let's have a look at it. Oh, there we go. Now these are. This took place in. I think it's in Korea. Uh, it's Taekwondo. Yeah, it's Taekwondo. <laughs> these are two junior world champions going at it. If you if you slightly squeamish, don't watch. That is the skipping. The constant skipping is my favourite. <laughs> <laughs> Watch this, my favourite bit is this kick. Yay! Little back heel. That's how I'd imagine. Why are they wearing helmets? It's just genius. Surely that's the warm up, right? That's the warm up. Right? <laughs> yeah. No, this is it. There uh, can't be any winners. There can't be a winner. What you really wanted was at the end, one of the kids just to go. And <laughs> <laughs> literally loud at the other. <laughs> Isn't it, isn't it, it must be the sort of Michael Flatley, uh, <laughs> the new martial, <laughs> river dance oh, martial art. Set that to the river dance music. Party in the house tonight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good Brilliant. stuff, oh. that is great. Oh. Um, I can imagine if, if David Silver, perhaps, and Juan Mata were to go at it in an actual fight, that's how it would look. <laughs> that is pretty much... I love the stance at the beginning. <laughs> you were still going down, so aggressive! <laughs> <laughs> But you, just, you guys I like dancing, I like dancing, like kicking, I like kicking. Watch me, watch me. Oi. Now listen, you know when you, you know when you, right, you know when you're at school. Here's a story. You know when you're at school and you go from like, you know when you play fighting as a kid, and then you probably get to the age 13, 14, you have like your first proper fight, and it's like a proper fight, and you know you're in a proper fight because some someone hits you in the face, and you don't do that ever before, ever. You've never it's hit always been pushing and. But, my mate, I had a guy called Joel who used to go to our school. I say mate, but he, he basically would always fight and he'd, he'd sort of, you know, when you play fighting, you do sound effects. He'd go, whoosh, whoosh. He got into a proper fight at school but carried on doing the sound effects <laughs> within the fight. And so he was like literally punching someone in the face, going, boosh, 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 boosh. Like, that was really weird. The weirdest thing I've ever I, I had a mate called Craig. I spat a lot there, I'm really sorry. I had a mate called Craig who did a similar thing, got an actual fight, did the sound effects, and then when the slug was lying on the floor, Finish jumped it. on him and shouted, elbow drop! <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Have you been in have you guys been in like proper fights? Y yeah. 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 Did you? Then did you I didn't win? make I didn't make the, no the noises though. No, I didn't make the noises. The, the, the kind of noises were the noises that, that Tom's your, chairs made. Your own win loss record. Yeah, Is that your Wikipedia page? One one last one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Location of fight behind bike sheds. I lost it. Yeah. <laughs> was, it, was it a technical knockout? Was it points? The what first was? one I got annihilated. But the thing is, I wasn't ready. I I'd, I'd only been playing. I wasn't ready, but I'd been play fighting like with my brother. That's all I'd known. And and he came straight in and smacked me like like across the cheek, and it sort of just shook me up a lot. I was like, I'm not ready for this. I don't think I'm ready for this. I don't hate you that much. You know, but it seemed like a good idea at the time. There were girls there, and I was like, yeah. And then did it, and I was like, oh. But the next one, I, I'd obviously prepared. And, um, you know, I like to think I won. But it's, it's heartbreaking when you get in that situation and you can't just go, Hadouken! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, real blow. But I, uh, fighting, my house mate, I got into a fight with him, but he's a different weight division. And I think that's, that's, <laughs> that's unfair. Is we're just sparring right? with someone. And then, um, so I'm a bit more sort of light mm. featherweight, and uh, he's more <clears throat> heavyweight. So it was just difficult, you know, he's mm. got more power. And was I it an actual of, fight? Nah, it was just like, you've got a minute, let's see how many points we can get. Mm. Just hitting each other in the face. Because the problem was, we watched the Amir Khan fight, we stayed up. Uh, and I quite like to get involved while watching the fight. I'm like, come on, Amir, do yeah. something. What's that? You know, yeah. It doesn't do me any good, and I've, I've learned nothing from it. But yeah. Sweet. I, I just love the fact that this is still going on. <laughs> in, the, in the background, these two are still dancing. Uh, I'm going to give the points uh, to that one, to... Uh, 
Oh, to Why Deco. Just because he's to the guest. Why me? Yeah, to the guest. I don't know. Uh, right now, let's should we do should we do round two? Because we've got another round as well. Yes, we've got a load of them. Uh, you're gonna love it. Uh, round two is our missing words round. Uh, we take a look at some tweets from the stars, and our guests have to fill in the blanks. All right. Let's mm -hmm. have a look at the first tweet, shall we? Missing tweets round. There it is. Uh, and uh, here's the first tweet. Who is it this week? It is Rio Ferdi. He says went toilet and had to tell a guy what? Oh, Smallman. Is it? Went to the toilet and had to tell a guy, no, it's not time for my drugs test. I'm not yeah. submitting a drugs test now. You know, when I saw this, I said in the office, I said, Jim's will be, went to the toilet and had to tell a guy to wee in my cup. So I knew it was a drugs test. <laughs> I, knew, I knew he'd bring back drugs test. Go on. Um, no, I don't want a lollipop and some cheap aftershave. Uh, ah. Well, I was thinking, uh, cultural, cultural went to the toilet that. and had to tell a guy what all the shouting was about. I'm constipated. <laughs> yeah. No, wasn't that either. Oh, okay. uh, Tom, any ideas? I uh, went to the toilet and had to tell a guy I won't be tweeting you. Um, yeah, that's, that's about it, really. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Is it went to the toilet and had to maybe tell Maybe that's a guy. the end. Maybe there's no black. Maybe, maybe it went to the toilet and had to tell a guy. Um, no. Yeah, let's have a look. Let's have a look at the That was better. That's tell the a guy, was guy Fawkes related let's story. What is it? A guy Fawkes related <laughs> Get lost in the man. It was, of course, <laughs> went to the toilet and had to tell a guy to do one after asking for a handshake. Do one? Yeah, do a one. Handshake and a do one. one. Well, I suppose because of the weed. Yeah, yeah. The, We've all yeah, been in that yeah. situation. Sure. Have we? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's <laughs> have a look at the next tweet. Let's have a look. Tweet number two. Who is it from? Uh, it's from Wazza. Great win yesterday after a bad week. Much needed. At Phil Jones, a.k.a. what was brilliant in midfield? Um, yep. Midfielder. A.k.a. <laughs> okay, yeah, midfielder. No. Any other suggestions? What uh, oh. You didn't sign your bell. Buzz Lightyear. What? Buzz Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear. No. Uh, shoddy centre-back. Shoddy. <laughs> I think he's good. At, I think that's harsh. I think you've been really harsh there. That's Thanks unfair. United. Do it, does anyone care? No, get lost, United. Any, any detail? Utility man. <laughs> Utility man. Let's Utility have a look see if you're right. Look at Wazza in that photo, by the way. Glenn Quagmire. Oh, yeah, OK. He doesn't look anything like no, Quagmire. not at all. Well, he's got a strong... I can see it. He's, uh, with Phil Jones, he's got a, a strong jaw. Jaw, jaw yeah. yeah. Yes, there you can see it. No, 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 that's cool not. Cool-thawed jaw. Mm. No. Giggity. You, can you do a Quagmire? You like Quagmire, don't you? No. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Do, do you think the, the nickname is because he has sex with a lot of ladies? <laughs> Ooh, allegations. Allegations. Um, <laughs> allegations in the building! <laughs> yeah, in, in the building. <laughs> Phil Jones is going to be the best England player uh, midfield by, by, before long. He's going to be our most looked upon player. I reckon. He's 19. That's what's ridiculous. He's incredible. He's great Imagine player. if I looked like that when I was 19. He's wasted at Blackburn, but now look at them. Yeah, yeah. Shocking. yeah shocking. How they miss him. Uh, I think I think Quagmire looks a little bit like Colin Murray. <laughs> Uh, don't you think? <laughs> Imagine if Quagmire was talking to Phil there. What would he, what would he say? <laughs> uh, let's not. Let's not. Let's go to the last tweet. Let's have a look at the last one. Uh, Wayne, look at that photo from, from Wayne. Good morning, world. There's nothing better than what in your own bed. Oh, oh we'll go Deco first. Starfishing. Starfishing <laughs> in your own bed. Weeing. Weeing in your own bed. Scarlett Johansson. Scarlett Johansson in your own bed. Uh, in your own bed. And yeah, he's written like a farmer, isn't it? In That's why he's got a bed. quad bike. Good morning, world. There's yeah. nothing better than in your own bed. <laughs> Eat a pasty um, in your own bed. Uh, well, keeping your life savings in cash stuffed in your own bed. Oh, oh, like in the current uh, economic climate, that there would be sensible. There is nothing better, yeah. uh, yeah. interest-wise. Let's see what you did actually mean to say. Oh, yeah. oh yep, yeah. up there. It's yeah. up there with some of the best. If uh, we were playing Family Fortunes bed. now, that would have been the bed. top answer. That's that a words grammatically incorrect from Wayne Routledge there. Yeah. Also, he's not wearing a helmet on that quad bike, which is uh, imitable behaviour, which is dangerous for us. It could a ruin his very um, could be fine. exciting career. To be fair, though, Wayne Routledge is quite small. That's just the child's remote control. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's on, yeah, he's on he's a micro machine. stuck on. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's at a boot sale, and his right. parents are just... <laughs> You're coming up, right? We've got some stuff, you guys. You one? guys, next round. Next, you're obviously... Ooh, stay with us, because... Uh, <laughs> I was going to just stay quiet until they went to a break. Here's a break. Uh-oh! Part three's in the building! You know what I'm talking about! <laughs> it's talking balls! Uh, uh, yes. Round three is through the webcam! What's happening? You right? Yeah. Sorry, because it was a bit weird what you did there. <laughs> you're right. You're right. I'm just finding today difficult. I've had a lot of bad do, news. What are you doing, like, up in the building, yo. Yeah. Just try that. Try it again. Okay. 
Round three is up in the building, yo. Be better? It's great. It's <sighs> just been a difficult day. I've had a lot of <laughs> stuff on and I just saw. Round three is through the webcam. The Sky just joins on the Sky wall. And I'll know who he supports these one, won't they have to guess? Uh, right, now we'll try and we'll bring it back. We'll bring it back. We'll bring it back. Yeah. We'll bring it back to that level. Yeah. We'll bring it back to that level, yeah. Because we'll you were really giddy in the break, and you, then you punched yourself in the chest like, yeah! It was and too much. You, you, it was too hard, you Gail G-vade yourself. Uh, now joining us on the Skype ball is Sean. Sean, how are you, mate? Yeah, I'm not too bad, Chris. How are you? Yeah, I'm not too bad, fella. Now listen, you guys have no idea, obviously, who Sean supports. What I'm going to ask you to do now is cover your eyes and your ears, just in case Sean speaks. Cover your eyes, cover your eyes. Uh, Sean, reveal a, a, a little something that says who you support now to me and the viewers at home. Okay, then. Uh, have you got, well, hang on. Have you, have you got something to tell us who you support? <laughs> Sorry? Have you got something? <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is going, going brilliantly. Well. Uh, have you got a bit of paper with you can write who you support on so that we all know? Yeah. Okay, good. Do that. Do that. We'll you, guys keep, you guys keep you guys <laughs> keep looking away. We'll That's out. great. That's good. Go on, show us now. Show us now. Show us now. Okay, all right. Now now drop it down. Drop it down. Okay. Brilliant. You guys can look now. Oh, back in the game. <laughs> What's in the box? I had a little What's in the box? What's in the box? I've asked him I had a little sleep. That's Sean Foy. He doesn't want to talk the about the box. He gets weird about it. Right, Sean, how are you, mate? Right, here we go. Do you want to show us your first clue? Ready, guys? Yep. Here's your first clue. First clue, Chris. Yep. Just bear with me for a second. Oh, we're oh, going through the move. Oh, where are we going? Where are we going, Sean? We're on the move. Curtains are closed. That's weird. Oh, oh nice, nice TV. Nice flat screen. Nice. <laughs> Draw's not shut, mate. OCD here. Yeah. <laughs> Did you get that in the looting? If you don't mind, Chris, I'm going to grab a drink. Oh, is that part of the clue? Ah. Oh, he's going to grab a... Oh, oh what's behind a, the drink? Titanic, Titanic, Titanic. Titanic, Titanic. 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 Okay, guys, have a little... Uh, oh. Is it Plymouth? No. Plymouth, it's not what? Plymouth. Huddersfield Town. Oh, <laughs> lucky. Are you having a guess, Tom? Well, Southampton. Uh, I'm just... I'll go Southampton. Yeah, Southampton. Yeah, that's ruined it. Oh, what? <laughs> uh, it's got to be a lot. It's my team. Uh, it's my team. It is your team. Round of applause for Tom Tico. He's cool. He's cool. One week. Sean, Sean, come, come, come back to, One to us. Your work. Sean, now listen. What we're going to do, because Dico ruined it in the first round. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's completely ruined. Uh, let, give, us, give us a tour of your house. Let's just look, Sean, at, your, let's look at where you live. Are we going to do it this season, Sean? Um, I hope so. Um... It's, it's possible. Um... It's manager. Is it Sean's <laughs> yeah. manager? <laughs> yeah, that's a real media answer. Sean, yeah. Sean, I want a tour of your house. I want to see. I want to see the real Sean. Move us around. Can I just say I love the way he stage managed that? I've just got to get a drink from <laughs> yeah, over here and reveal the picture. <laughs> do you know what the, you know what the best? Well, what were the other clues? I would like yeah, to know the other. Okay, clues. let's see the other clues. Let's see the other clues. See the other clues. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, right. Okay. Well, my second clue was. <laughs> Gonna be over here. We come down past my DVD tower. Sure, sure. DVD <laughs> tower. <laughs> 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 Sean, 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 Sean. Oh, in the cupboard, in the cupboard. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Stick together. Come on. Why does that tickle me so much? Okay, what's in the locker? <laughs> what's in your locker? <laughs> Uh oh! Uh oh! We're going in. It's Matt Letizia's head. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <Yo>, Matt! <laughs> what? What is it, Sean? <laughs> what is oh, that's. What is it? That looks like binary code from here, mate. It looks like binary code. What is it? What is it? What is it? Is it a picture of oh, Southampton? Who was this? Who? Oh. What oh, is that? It's a Spitfire. Oh, it's a Spitfire. Geographical, historical, yeah, yeah. Okay, what was clue three? So Take us back past the DVD tower. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. Oh, that's about the TTA head. <laughs> this has been the best day of my life. What? Oh, what's that? Hang on, that's another DVD tower. No, it was the same one. Oh, same one from a different angle. <laughs> um, okay, keep going. What's up in the building? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, clue number three. I feel yeah. sick. <laughs> yeah. well, I should have put this as number one, really, but this is clue number three. Oh, we can just see the laptop reflected. Hang on. Oh, oh what is it? Southampton village. Is it village. A, village? <laughs> uh, no, uh, a garage, a bus, it's a, it's a, it's a picture of a street. Yep. In Southampton. 
<laughs> What's funny, if we hadn't got it then, you know, we're in more cool than us. Can I just say, what's funny, that's that's an up-to-date photo, that one. <laughs> 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 I'm not, I'm not having a go, so I'm sure, but... Sean, do you live in Southampton? Yeah, I do. It's almost like that's the clue. And by the way, all this has been shot in Southampton, <laughs> clue four. Where about, um, whereabouts in Southampton, Sean? No, because like, people go and visit him. No, they won't. All right. <laughs> Never yeah, seen his DVD. Yeah, he's, just shown, he's just shown a DVD tower and a flat screen. Hang on, TV. I'll, I'll guess. How about, I'll guess. I'll okay, guess. Go, from, go, from, go, from, go. The, from what's there? Are you? You look like um, it, down in Chandler's Ford. No. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, well, that was great. It was good fun. It was great TV. Uh, sure, mate. <laughs> mate, it's been an absolute pleasure. You've been a hero, and um, I'm sure we'll speak to you again soon. Is there anything you want to say before you go? Sorry? Is there anything you want to say before <laughs> no you go? There's no need to apologise. Don't worry, Sean. I will be there on Boxing Day, if that was your question. I will be watching Palace Saints. Don't you worry, Sean. I, 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 can't, I, can't, I couldn't quite hear that. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. It was Zico being Zico. Uh, right. Absolute pleasure. Well, Take care. The Crystal Palace game on Boxing Day. Oh, yes. yes. There we go. Right. See you later, mate. All the best. Yes, Sean. 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 Must guess this one wrong <laughs> I this week. I love Sorry, it. I do like throughout the Titanic. It's not going to be an Irish football team, is it? I know it was made in, in Ireland. It's going to be Titanic, terrible. Spitfire, and then a tram. He's very, very transport links related, isn't he? Mm. He's, 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 mm. he's, is this one of those awkward moments, like life's too short, where he's still on the line? We're <laughs> 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 yeah. just ripping him now from now on, and then still there, Sean. <laughs> what? I can't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> Matt Letizia's head would have been the greatest of the clues. Uh, right, round four is my big impression. Uh, basically, this week, I, we, we usually make a phone call. I pretend to be someone, and you guys have to guess whether it's going to go well or not. Um, I do a good quagmire, or is that too late? <laughs> what we're going to do, here's what we're going to do. Chris is Chris's right. Chris is Chris's. Sorry, this is Chris's. his time to shine. It's my, it's my bit. It's Chris's bit. Chris is up in the building! <laughs> Boom! Um, right, so basically what we're going to do, Fernando Torres obviously not having a great time at Chelsea, Drogba now taking up the mantle, he's doing well. So what we thought, he's feeling a little bit glum, wants a bit of sponsorship, got to keep his media present. So Nando Torres is going to call Nando's and see if he can get them to sponsor him for a year. All right, so that's the call we're about to make. We'll see, or do you think it's going to go, do you think he's going to get sponsorship? No. No? No. Have a bit of faith. I, I reckon it's happening. Okay. Fernando Torres has got lovely hair. I'm going to use you, so be aware. <coughs> They're busy. Mm. Peak period. It's all that walk into people's tables. How can I help you? Oh, hello. Um, I'm finding it a little bit difficult at the moment, and I was looking for maybe some sort of support, and I wonder if you'd be interested in maybe sponsoring me. Right, so sorry, so the, the call is not very good. They couldn't understand what it said. Sorry. It's no, it's You're not very good morning. at the moment, no. Uh, basically, my name, I play football for a big team, and I like, I like chicken, and I have a name similar to you, and I would like you to sponsor me, please. So, you, you come in the morning, you order chicken, what's happened? <laughs> I didn't... <laughs> I have no order because, chicken. Sorry, because the call, I can't understand you, what you're saying because the call Okay, I speak, I, I speak slowly for you. I, okay. I play football for a big uh, team in London, but at the moment it's not going well. And what I would like is for you to sponsor me. Uh, Nando is like my name. I, my name is Fernando. You are Nando. We don't have to change a lot on the T-shirt. And I just want to be involved, if possible, with, with Nando's as a collaboration, please. Do, do you speak Portuguese? Uh, no, I speak Espanol. Uh, ¿Habla Espanol? Se fala Portuguese. Uh, un momento, por favor. Donde está mi... Because, because the call is not because it's speaking fast or slow. The call, I can't understand. The call is not good. Ay, it's caramba. Like... Uh, un, uh, un momento. <laughs> Uh, I have a friend who speaks a clearer. His name is Colin Murray. He with me now. Can can you speak to Colin? Hang on. I I, I, I pass I pass you over to Colin. Hey, is that? Am I, are you? Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Hello. Is that Nando's? Hello. 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 Can you hear us? 
Daniel speaking. How can I help? Oh, hello. My name is uh, Fernando. Um, I play football for a big team in London, and uh, you have a similar name. I would like to make a sponsorship deal or something. Mate, you've got a really bad reception. I can hardly hear a word you're saying. I got a bad reception, but that's because Didier is playing well, and I'm not. <laughs> And I come on the pitch and everyone's like, boo, and I'm like, hey, I used to be very good. And it's not, it's not fair. But that's, by the by, I will turn a corner. Hey, I'll pass you off to Colin. Again? One second. Un momento, por favor, y se porta y se mata y se para tu sonido. Colin Murray. Colin Murray. Hey, are you there? <laughs> Hello. Yeah. Hello, right. Um, I'm here with Fernando Torres. And uh, he's you looking... Fernando? No. I don't work for... No. <laughs> I do match of the day too. <laughs> I'm here with Fernando Torres and he would like to get sponsorship. Is that possible? Because his name sounds like Nando's. You're coming to fix the auto, Sean. Okay. Um, adios. <laughs> ah, I don't think that went well. I don't think that went well. You're coming to fix the auto glass? My, my favourite thing was... Do you speak Portuguese? <laughs> it's like, yeah, that would have been easier <laughs> if you just started yeah. speaking Portuguese to him. What I like is that they, they went to have Espanol and he went, yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. Because your Spanish is, of course, made up, isn't it? No, it's more, more uh, freestyle. Uh, freestyle Espanol. Ay, <laughs> <I> caramba. <laughs> <laughs> I, you said ay, ay. I thought that's what they say. Bad reception. Nice. Bad reception, nice. yeah, you yeah. got that. Yeah. Uh, anyway, so you got a point, you got a point, you didn't. Uh, but you had an opportunity enough. to save it. You know, you're Colin Murray. He <laughs> just didn't like Colin. Took over as Colin. He said, at that point, he said, do, do you want to do the windows? I said, what are you talking with a Northern Irish accent? My, my hometown, <laughs> nothing, nothing. He, he didn't like that. Uh, it's one that, was, that was good. It's one of my favourites so far. <laughs> uh, anyway, right. Uh, still more to come, including what we're doing in the next part. Let me have a look. Uh, oh, you'll love it. Uh, join us after the break. Welcome back to Talking Balls. This is the uh, fourth part, final part. This is the last part. This is part of the show. Uh, whether it's the last part or not will depend on whether there's a part after this. You decide. Uh, round five <laughs> is Talking Balls. Uh, we've all got a story, football related. Uh, we're going to read it out from a card and the rest of us, uh, after whoever's read it has read it, have to decide whether it's true or false. Whether we're telling the truth or whether we're talking balls. <laughs> ah, such a good one. Uh, who wants to go first? You're in charge. Okay. I'll, I'll go first. Go, Tom. All right, okay. Um, do I read it off my card? Yes, please read it yeah, off your card. card. I accidentally put it on the wrong... Ah, oh, amateur. Okay. Was it, did it happen in Australia? Yep. Oh, lovely stuff. Really That's good. That's in New Zealand. Nice. Ah. Kia ora, bro. Um, <clears throat> once at an Ipswich versus Birmingham City game, five minutes before the end, my dad wanted to leave before the rush. Yep. I needed the toilet, so went. Kieran Dyer ended up peeing next to me. Awkwardly, I ran out afterwards and waited for him to sign my program. He hadn't washed his hands. Whoa, okay, now hang on a minute. Um, Big. Kieran Dyer. So, was Kieran injured at the time? Of course he was, he's Kieran Dyer. <laughs> <laughs> what was the score? What was the score of the game? Uh, it finished 1-0. 1-0. Against okay. Birmingham City. Okay. Scintillating. City. Okay, and um, so you went to the lose in the stand, you peed next to him. Did, did you have any exchange while you were weeing? No, only the kind of glancing as a, you know, Did he, was he guy. like, is that Tom T? We, 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 <laughs> <laughs> is that what you mean? Is, he, is that Colin Murray? That pop music. <laughs> well, I really like pop music. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this uh, is a few years ago, but... Um, how many uh, years ago? How old were you? Uh, uh, 14. So two right? years ago. That, yeah, two that years looks ago. like lying. Mm. Looked like trying you know what though, but I think it's so detailed and so specific that it's probably true. But we should, we, what do we think? Let's have a vote. I think Still it's fun. true. I think it's a lie. I think it's. I think you're talking the truth. Uh, so Tom, tell us. Is it? Uh, you haven't got a button, and you can't. Come, something can't come up behind you. It is in fact a lie. Uh, you can't do that. Is it true or false? It's true. Hey! It's well quite an awkward exchange, really. Oh. But at least you, unlike the guy in, in uh, Rio Ferdinand's tweet, at least you waited until you yeah, vacated the gents, which is uh, good. golden rule to yeah, everyone. Yeah, if you want to golden, be the golden word. Right there. <coughs> uh, Jim, what's, Jim, what's yours? <coughs> I once kissed Nigel Pearson on the face and he pushed me over in shock and anger. <laughs> okay, where were you? Um, South End. What, a football game? A football game, yeah. Right. Leicester City versus South End at United. Where, more specifically, within South End? Indoors? I was in the press box. 
What were you doing there? Reporting. Um, I was pretending to be a journalist so I could get into a game for free. And you chose that one. It was the it was the game See, where it was the on. game where we won the League One title. See, I can imagine a hug. I can imagine a hug, but mm. a kiss on the face seems too much. Seems almost unbelievable. Seems almost like you're talking balls. <laughs> <laughs> and when he pushed, so he pushed you over. Uh, pushed yeah. me over a chair. So did you fall I fully fell, flat? Did fully you, fell over. Did you hurt yourself? Did someone put uh, the chair there? You know, like sometimes when you you wait until someone's behind and down. then you push them. No, no it wasn't Milan Mandaric on all fours behind him, just shoving me <laughs> if over. You want, I'll go. Um, um, but no, um, he, he pushed me over and I fell over a chair. Mm. And um, he, the, didn't, he didn't apologise. It's the kiss that upsets me. I, I'm going to say talking balls. Um, I'm going to say talking balls. I'm going to say truth. What is that? We've got to take the majority. Violent. We're going to take talking balls. What is it? It's the truth. Oh! Yeah. You kissed him on the face. Very, very uncomfortable being kissed by another man. I bet, yeah. He's I unco- I'll, be fa- I'll be honest with you. Most people are. If you're press, he's uncomfortable with anyone. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he's, not, he's, not, he's not jolly. He's not the jolliest. He's a very good football manager, but not the jolliest man in the world. Neil, what's yours? Um, uh, for one match only, I was the mascot uh, at a Mexican uh, football match. Okay. In how, Mexico. How old were you? I don't know why he struggled to read that yeah. so badly. Yeah, <laughs> weird, isn't it? Maybe he was lying. No, maybe um, he was putting it on to make us think he was. Uh, what did you say? Talking balls. <laughs> <laughs> I want glasses yeah, so I can do yeah, that. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. What happened? You, were a, you were a mascot. <laughs> you were the Mexican mascot at a Mexican football match. I was the mascot at, the, a, at a Mexican football match. What sort of mascot? Did you have to hold hands? I, I ran onto the pitch. Oh, so like the kid mascot? I ran mascot. around the pitch. No, 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 not the kid mascot. Like with a, the, the Yeah, with a costume. What was it? It was a lion. What was the yeah. lion's name? I think you're lying. Uh, well, the team really is good. Leon, Leon, really and it was Leon the lion. <laughs> Leon the lion. Yeah. Leon the lion. Leon, okay. which means lion in Spanish. Uh, correct. And what were you yeah. doing in so Mexico? So you were Leon, Leon. Yes. Lion, yeah. lion. <laughs> what, what, what were you doing <laughs> in Mexico? The, the badge is a, is a lion. Um, <laughs> what were you doing there? I, I was making a television program, and okay. we were it's doing a feature it. about this. Oh, there might well be. Mm. Uh, I'm going to say, I'm going to say true. He's a, he's a, he's got a very believable face, isn't he? Mm. Neil. <laughs> Not when you do that. Limming coal. Uh, look at him. Go on, then. Sure, fast. Sure, talking balls. Sure, talking balls. Here the we only go. person wearing a jacket in the studio. I know. Well, what does so that tell you? Set the heating up. Um, <laughs> I'd say it's true. I'm going to say it's true because he's a well travelled man. I'm going to say true too. What is it? It's true. Hey! I, 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 my, my claim to fame was I was in I was in the lion costume and I ran around and the the it was a uh, club Leon uh, versus uh, Irapuato and uh, the other uh, mascot who was just as a, like a enlarged kid uh, sort of costume kept running towards me and trying to and I tripped him up and he went flying. Hey! <laughs> I'm loving the mascots that. fight. It's brilliant. Oh, it's it the best. There, there was recently the best mascot picture was just um, the Arsenal team for a, for a silent. I don't know what they were doing a minute silence for, but he just had the uh, the green. <laughs> the <laughs> the dragon, dragon, yeah. It just joined them for the silence. <laughs> 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 oh, it, now, that sort of just, ruins it. Sort of ruins it. <laughs> All the players were just quite somber. They have a minute silence. He just <laughs> <laughs> the dragon, did, he, did the dragon shake his head like? <laughs> I like to think he's Per Mertesacker because he's tall enough when he's all around him. <laughs> just, just looking at the floor and you, just, you can't help but just look and go, that's not right. There's something wrong with that. It's inappropriate. Genius. Right, last one. Mama La Mulia is This is yours, Chris. Book. It's my one. Okay. Uh, I once pretended to be a new Spanish signing for Wigan and got removed from the players' lounge by Dave Whelan. After hearing that Spanish accent. <laughs> <laughs> There's got to be a reason he practised that. Yeah. Where, where, was try and speak where, 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 uh, in the, pl- in the, the VW, players, yeah. the DW, in the, in the right. players' lounge. So basically, yeah, I, I was there pretending to be a player who I. Which player? Anyone? Uh, it was a guy I called myself Eleganso, and so I had you a made book. up a player. I'd made a book uh, with my face on, and I was trying to sell my book, and I bought Wigan's, but I couldn't buy Wigan's current training kit, so I bought last season training kit. Dressed up, had headphones on like a player would, <laughs> walked straight through. Uh, and the two guys at the door let me in, got into the players' lounge, panicked, didn't know what to do. Dave Weed had approached me and asked me what I was doing there and asked me to leave. That was, that was pretty much the full extent. And that's, that's, that's totally that's true. Completely you'd, true. So, you'd so do that. Yeah. Yeah, true. Why would, you, balls. Why, would, why would you do that? Because Wigan will sign anyone. So <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bearing in mind, this is the man who just called up a branch of Nando <laughs> pretending to be yeah. Fernando Torres. That is true. Um, uh, so, that yeah, true. what do you reckon? True. To be fair, he'd still be better than Franco Di Santo. <laughs> so. Oh, hello. Come on. He scored three goals. Yeah. <laughs> 40 appearances. Three whole goals in 40. He, so. He's not an out and out goal scoring striker. He, he's more of a support striker. Yeah, that's why he's six foot six. six. He is a threat, though. He's a threat. <laughs> I, I'm going to say that's false because I don't know why you would want to do that at Wigan. Mm. Balls, true and true. Is it talking balls? 
Guys, I, uh, I'm not talking balls. It's true. <laughs> okay. It's true. Oh. So the, it was three. Uh, we did it as a, a stunt uh, for another for another show I work on. But I yeah, literally went in, started. I, it felt awful. Did you have people were giving cameras? me people were giving me football football that was signed by all the players <gasps> and asked me to sign it. I went, oh no, I better not. I better not. And then I went, please, please, please. And so I was like, wrote it really <laughs> small, like eleganzo. <laughs> <laughs> And I went, I'm injured at the moment. Anyway, and then, so I just... I'm changing it. your name in my photo. Yeah, yeah, this, yeah. Basically, there was a little, tiny, tiny television company that did an interview with me, right? Didn't do any research, obviously. Didn't interview me. And then I walked into the players' lounge after that. So that's why the people on the door thought I was legit, because I'd done an interview. Walked mm. in, and Dave Whelan came over to me and went, Who are you? <laughs> and I went, Back, adios! <laughs> so I'm Thank you, Amber. Thank you, Amber. Uh, listen, guys, absolute pleasure today, as always. So Big thanks four truths. To yeah, four truths. We are great at this. Uh, the really rubbish Motown thanks. band. <laughs> the four truths. 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 Hey. 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 I just feel bad hey. about the football keep you up, so I do apologise. Don't worry, it gives, it gives someone coach. belief next time they do it. Uh, thanks for watching Talking Balls. We'll see you next time. Cheerio!